Catherine Albertson Park gives people the chance to experience the quiet of nature in the heart of Boise. For the last two years, the city has worked on improvements funded by the J.A. and Catherine Albertson Family Foundation. And it really turned out better than what we imagined and I think better than what the foundation imagined. In 1979, Joe Albertson donated this pasture to the city and it would become one of the best places to slow down and enjoy the fall colors. This new boardwalk has opened up a whole new section of the park for the first time ever. Uh, we built some overlooks or some uh, piers inside uh, the pond so that now you can actually walk out into uh, uh, above the pond and observe some of the ecosystems, some of the wildlife that we have in this park. The city also updated signage, created a new bathroom and took out most of the turf replacing that with natural grasses, which made the park less desirable for the geese that crowd just about every other park in the city. They don't like the meadow grass. That is not um, something that they are uh, accustomed to eating. It's more of the turf that they are more desirable towards. And also, because it's a little bit taller, it really doesn't give the geese uh, that protection that they like to have from predators. But overall, I think just the improvements to this park, a park that arguably is one of the greatest urban nature parks in the country, and we've just made it better. And if you talk to anyone here, uh, this is probably the number one place to come to for two things. One, to bird watch because of the population of the birds we have. And two, if you are a high school student and you're going to the prom or you're going to homecoming, this is where you're coming to get your pictures taken. Catherine Albertson's park creates a photographer's dream and the two gazebos can be rented out for a few hours at $100. I've seen weddings happen here, and Doug Holloway's daughter had her ceremony a year ago. It was awesome. Uh, actually, it was very awesome. And, and we also got to enjoy bringing um, my new son-in-law's family from San Diego to Boise to enjoy this, not only just the city of Boise, but this park and this park that we selected to have a wedding for my own daughter here. And they really loved it and enjoyed it and are looking forward to coming back and enjoying this park now that all the improvements have been completed. Biking, swimming, and fishing are all prohibited here in Catherine Albertson's park, but that's also what makes this park unique. Steve Dent, Idaho News 6.